a model to help learn the process of fractional distillation. As we know from our video about the process of fractional distillation, a fractionating tower, or column, is where cold liquid crude oil is pumped in and then heated, with the temperature decreasing towards the top of the tower. So if we know the boiling points of the hydrocarbons, we can separate off the different fractions, which are, starting at the base, with a higher boiling point, bitumen, heavy fuel oil, lubricating oil, diesel, kerosene, petrol, known as gasoline, and refinery gases. But how can we remember the process to separate these fractions? Let's use this easy to learn model with a giraffe. This is Jiffy, the giraffe. We love Jiffy. Jiffy eats grass, like this. Grass is full of carbohydrates, or CH for short. This is Jiffy. This is Jiffy. Jiffy eats grass, shortened to CH, and makes gas when digesting the grass. And also, here is Jiffy's voice box. Here. And this is now the model of Jiffy. This is Jiffy the giraffe. And this is Jiffy the model. The giraffe Jiffy. The model Jiffy. But Jiffy dies. Oh no. But does so in a comedy manner. So that's okay. Jiffy dies like this. Jiffy dies like this. But don't be sad, because this is the model that will help us. Because this is the model of Jiffy, which is a model of a fractionating tower or column. Here is Jiffy lying down. And here is where Jiffy used to eat carbohydrates, but not anymore. Because now it goes in here but not carbohydrates. Instead, we use HC, which stands for hydrocarbons in the form of crude oil, which is cold and liquid and is pumped in here. At Jiffy's voice box is where the crude oil is heated. And instead of the gas being expelled here anymore, the gas comes out of Jiffy's foot, like this. So leaving the other states of matter of liquid and solid. Wow! If we look at our Jiffy model, the gas, now given out from Jiffy's foot, we can name as methane, which is itself a refinery gas. But what liquid-based hydrocarbons do we know? I know! Cars! They use this. Petrol, also called gasoline. So we can replace the liquid with its correct fraction. So that leaves us the solid which is located here. But how can we remember that? Well, using our Jiffy model, the solid fraction is found here. The solid is found at the base. The solid hydrocarbon is found at the bottom of the tower. At the bottom, which sounds like bitumen, the solid residue left when separating crude oil. So here, at the base of Jiffy, the solid fraction is called bitumen and is also known as tar. And another fact we know is that lorries use diesel as a fuel. When we compared petrol or gasoline with diesel, petrol is lighter in colour than diesel. And when comparing flammability, petrol is easier to ignite and diesel is less flammable. And petrol burns with a quite clean flame, whereas diesel burns with a dirtier, smokier flame. So in our model Jiffy, using our knowledge of the different fractions, petrol, or gasoline, located here, can be moved upwards, to here. And at this location, we can extract diesel. That's amazing! So with this giraffe, Jiffy the giraffe, who we love, we can model like this, and then place end on instead, and the crude oil is pumped in where the head would be, and at the voice box, we can heat the mixture and from previous knowledge, identify at least four fractions 
each matching one of Jiffy's feet. Jiffy the giraffe. What a great model. Please do watch our video about using our Jiffy the giraffe model to help answer related exam questions. Please subscribe to my channel. Bye.